Okay, today's quick tip is gonna be whole patterns. Uh, whole patterns is a drawing feature you'll find under Create 2D called Whole Pattern. And this is a, actually a very powerful and a simple tool to use in order to create either circular or uh, grid patterns for holes. Uh, we'll start out with the circular one. We can give it a start angle, an end angle, and like a bolt circle diameter. So we can adjust this number bigger or smaller and you'll see how it grows um, on the screen. We can tell it how many holes we wanna work with. We can tell it the size of those holes. We can make those holes bigger, we can make them smaller. So you can see this is really easy to set up. One of the things that you'll notice is there's points in the center of the holes. Uh, if you choose break arc, then you'll just get the circles. Uh, if you have the points in the center of the holes, it's a whole pattern, so it's kind of like a grouping function. Now, you can change the origin just by typing in a value that you may want. Um, you can also put the depth that you might want to drill to uh, just by entering a Z value as well. Uh, so you can set up a circular grid very quickly uh, and easily. Okay, the other thing you can do I'm sorry, a circular pattern. You can also set up a grid pattern. A grid pattern, you may have um, uh, a, a width and a height that you use. You may set the number in X and the number in Y. Uh, what's pretty useful about this as well is again, you can use your origin to adjust where it's located. You can use your Z value to determine how deep those holes are gonna go. But you can also just adjust um, the row. So you could do like a single row of holes. Okay, uh, maybe you want it going the other way. We can make this for that way. Okay, so just by using some uh, input values here, it's very quick and easy to set up either a grid or a circular hole pattern.